Hello everybody and welcome to today's very exciting reaction video. Um, today we're going to be reacting to Salma, who we have reacted to at least once before. Um, so message says, please reaction for Salma's second single, Bunga Hati. It was on trending now. So this is this was released just two weeks ago. Had three million views. Uh, do you remember young Selma? Selma? Oh, I feel like I do. Um, I mean, the name definitely it sounds to me. I feel like we haven't done it for a while. Because was there someone similar to Selma as well? Was there two of them who were quite similar? I can't remember. Let's right. go. Okay. I'll we will do. <laughs> Sekian lamanya kita tak berjumpa Namun tak sengaja berpapasan ku denganmu Tatapan yang sama rasanya yang lama Namun ku kecewa kau tak peka oh, Telah lama ku menunggu dirimu Coba hubungi ku salah hatiku Early pause there. Um, yeah, I was kind of a bit surprised by how what happened to the song there because it, it's kind of quite funky. I didn't see that coming oh. from, for, at the beginning of it. It seemed like it was going to be like a nice, I don't know, a little slow song. Um, but yeah, suddenly it sort of got all funky. So that's the, the sort of uh, type of song it is. You enjoying it so far, Lady Doors? Um, yeah, I really am. I was there wasn't the hesitation was there whatsoever to um, give my full full opinions early doors, but as early as it is, yeah, really enjoy enjoying the whole sort of um, vibe of the video as well. The sort of nineties kind of home video kind of feel yeah. to it. Um, the music, so yeah, um, real real good feelings for this one. This is a bit of you, isn't it? The, yeah, this this could be. I mean, there's a lot of things a bit of me, but yeah, this yeah, this must be somewhere a bit of me. Yeah, definitely. Wahai kau bunga hatiku menanti dirimu. Sekian lamanya kita tak berjumpa, namun tak sengaja. Over to to you, Backstreet Brett. What you thought of that? Yeah, really, really 
enjoyed that. Um, it's funny, like when we do album reviews, one of my sort of go-to phrases is whether the song's sort of a, a toe tapper or a head bopper, and that is a toe tapper head bopper. If I've, if I could, <laughs> if I, best way to describe that one there. Really enjoyed that. It had a real nice sort of summer vibe to it. And maybe because it's freezing cold where I am at the moment, just watching that feeling nice and warm, just uh, good feeling. Love the sort of, you know, sort of the 90s nostalgia stuff to it. But obviously it has that sort of 70s. It's almost like <laughs> a song done in the 90s imitating the 70s tunes and feelings brought to a modern modern day twist. So, yeah, a bit of everything in, in that regard. Uh, really nicely sung. And what's really interesting me from that is that we had the sort of um, translation lyrics up on there i wasn't really paying attention to those at all normally we always have always said normally songs so we don't understand the uh, the language for so it'll be good if we can have some of the lyrics but for that i it, it didn't I, I wasn't paying attention at all it just felt like a good happy good feel trip didn't matter what she was she couldn't be singing about anything and i would still be toe happy i'll still be I'll still have the same feelings, that makes sense. Didn't necessarily need the lyrics um, for that one. Just a real good, happy tune. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing as we're getting towards the end of the song. I was like, well, actually, I'm not really paying attention to the lyrics. It's, it's, I wonder if Brett's even mm. like looking at them because I just think it's that type of song. It's not, it doesn't, the lyrics aren't that important, really. It's more mm. about the feeling of the song, the, the, the vibe of it, rather than, it's not, I don't think it's a deep, meaning song. It's not a criticism, it's just the type of song that, that it is. Um, so yeah, I wasn't paying attention to the lyrics. I couldn't tell you what that song was about, despite it being up in front of me. I was actually kind of reading it, but just wasn't really taking it in, because it just didn't really seem to need it. Yeah, uh, it's more about the, the feeling of the song, a sort of a happy go song. Um, yeah, I like what you said there, um, that it had that kind of 90s video feel to it. Yeah, it felt kind of, you know, homemade. 90s feel there was sort of the dancing and the dance going on in the background um but yeah it had a sort of 70s musical feel to it as well hmm. um so yeah no, it's listen it's not a song i'm gonna put on a, on a playlist but just a nice pleasant well, sort of like summer sounding song um it's just you know harmless fun nice to listen to um so yeah that's it from us guys i forgot to mention earlier if you donate to our channel we will guarantee um and prioritize any reactions that you um have for us we have so many we can't do them all um we'd love to listen to salma again and other indonesian uh groups and singers so, yeah, I think that's all I wanted to say. That's that's it from us. So, terima kasih for watching. I'll see you again soon for the next one. Take care.